Hello everyone, today we're going to make apple pastry turnovers. So what you're going to need is one large apple diced, one fourth a cup of sugar, a fourth a teaspoon of cinnamon, one egg beaten, one package of puff pastry sheets that are store bought. Right now you'll mix the cinnamon and the sugar together. You will then add it to the apples and then mix in the apples and get it all mixed in well. Once it's all mixed in, we're going to set it aside and start with the puff pastry sheets. You'll then open up the pastry sheets. This is a nice brand because it kind of opens up and it's got the forms already pretty much there so you just have to slice down the center of them and then just cut across to make your middle cut and then you'll have three pastries that you'll be making out of this one pastry sheet. So we will then put the egg wash around the edges of the pastry. And you only need to do it on one side. We will then add in the apple cinnamon mixture to the center of the pastry. And you could put in a good couple of scoops of the apples, um, make it pretty plump and full uh, because this pastry is going to puff up and then if you only put in a little bit of apple then you're not going to have much filling. So I like to put in a little more than what you should so that you have a lot of apples in your pastry once it's, it's finished. You'll then take the other half of the pastry and just kind of form it on top of the apple filling. And then you'll take a fork with some flour. Um, you can dip it in the flour just to make so that the fork doesn't stick to the pastry. And then just kind of press it all around the edges to kind of seal in the pastry mixture. And then once you are completed with all four sides, you'll finish up the other two and then put them onto a, a baking sheet that is got parchment paper on it. And then you will be able to put it into the oven to cook. And this pastry sheets come with two, so you could make up to six separate um, little apple turnovers. And here you go, I finished up the other sheet, so now I have my six. I'm going to now take a knife and put some cuts across the pastry so that it's able to vent and breathe. And that's just so that it doesn't um, puff up and then pop on you in the oven. It kind of gives it a chance to let some of that steam out. You will then take the egg wash again and just cover the top of the pastry with all of the egg. This will make it nice and brown and crispy when you get done cooking it.
and you will want to preheat your oven to, to 350. Now we've put them in the oven and we're going to bake it for 20 minutes. Uh, you might want to check it. My oven takes 20, it might take 30 for yours. Um, here they are finished after they've baked for their 20 minutes. You are now able to add some powdered sugar if you choose and then just enjoy the apple turnovers. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you give this recipe a try and I thank you for watching. Have a great day.